to another video. Today I am drawing my subscribers dares, art dares to be specific. I know some people do these just with dares, but you know, I wanted to do something different. So this was actually probably about three weeks ago. I posted a short video asking you to comment some art dares and sadly I wasn't able to do all of them for this video, but I picked some of the most crazy ones and put them for today. So let's go ahead and get into the video. First dare was to paint a fruit with the fruit I'm gonna paint. Jasmine, that that was that was such a challenge. Wow. So <laughs> let's just go ahead and do this. I went ahead and grabbed some strawberries, slapped them in the microwave, and then proceeded to mash the living daylights out of these. So once they were mashed up, I ran them through a strainer just to get the chunks out, and I made this sort of paint. I added a little bit of water to some in that small jar just to make it a light, lighter color, attempting, well, you know, attempting to make a lighter color. I was hoping it'd be a little more vibrant than it was, but it's strawberry, so, you know, I don't expect a miracle. But I was, I was quite uh, impressed with what I got. You know, strawberry is one of the first things that popped into my mind because they are very, very full of pigments. Like, I was, thought I could do a mango, but mango? I didn't really know how I'd make a, quote, paint from that. So I went with strawberry. So here's the end result. I am quite pleased with it. Unfortunately, I have to throw it away because it's gonna mold. I mean, it's already turned like a darker color, so. But it was, it was a very fun experience. The next stair was to draw Brindley skydiving and eating cake. So, up until now, I have not had a lot of experience with uh, really different poses. So this, honestly, it didn't turn out that bad. It was pretty cute, I'm gonna say. I don't really know if the pose was stiff or not. I also really need to work on hands because they're very difficult to draw. But I think I managed, drew a little cake in her left hand. And yeah, it, I think it looked pretty cute. I just ended up doing a line art because I knew coloring it would take an eternity. Here's how it turned out. <laughs> it's so cute. I love it. I'm sorry if you can't see the cake, but she is eating cake. I promise. Rachu had a very interesting dare. She dared me to create a character with a yellow and gray scheme, which luckily I have a pretty big set of Ohuhu markers, so I was able to make that work, and I'm really pleased with how it turned out. was to do the same steps I always do when I draw, but in alphabetical order. So instead of lining it first, I had to draw it with my colors. So I had to figure out where the iris was going to be, I had to figure out where the skin was going to be, and I, I didn't, I couldn't sketch it out first and I could not line it. 
now. It turned out decent, but <laughs> honestly, it is not my best piece, and uh, it's really not my favorite. There's just something about it, and I'm sure I could figure it out. It's probably just because I couldn't sketch it in first, which is always what I do. But it was a very interesting day, and I accepted your challenge, so... Can't, can't come at me for trying. <sighs> it's, it's still kind of terrifying. The last one, Ava asked me to draw my biggest fear. And I don't really have a lot of fears, but I do not like small, tight spaces. So there was really no way I could think of to draw that, but I just drew a little cube with a stick person in it. Hi, so there was really no quick way I could think of to make an outro for this video. It just kind of ends abruptly on the last dare. So I just decided to custom tape a quick video saying thank you for watching. And also I want to show you something. I uh, sculpted a tiny Brinley. I mean, it's it's a little rough looking, but I think she's pretty cute. It's Brinley. Uh, I I don't really do a lot of sculpting, but I wanted to make her to go next to my custom 100 YouTuber plaque that I made a long time ago, just to you know. I think they look really cute together. Comments, some videos you want me to make, they could be art craft related, just anything creativity. And feel free to share my channel and videos with your friends. We are getting so close to 1k. We will definitely be at 1k by the end of December. It's exciting. I will hopefully be able to make my first live soon. I cannot wait for that. So Thank you for watching, have a beautiful day, and I will see you in my next video!